harmful mutations, but hopefully we are able to live a healthy life without any diseases. This is because our bodies have an army. This army is called the repair mechanism. This repair mechanism has the ability to protect our bodies from any harmful mutations. But imagine that these harmful mutations escape from this repair mechanism. So serious diseases will happen. But even if nowadays serious diseases can be repaired. So it's time to say hi to Genome of My name is Mohammed Nasruddin. I'm a student from the Science Helwan University, Nuclear Biotechnology Department, standing before you today to tell you what is genome editing. Genome editing is a technique used to precisely and efficiently modify the DNA. And by doing that, the characteristic of a cell or an organism can be changed. There are many applications on genome editing, on research to understand the biology of a cell or an organism and how they work, to treat diseases such as AIDS and muscular dystrophy, and for agricultural applications to genetically modify crops to improve their yields and the disease resistance. But now, how does genome editing work? Genome editing uses a type of enzyme which is called engineered nuclease. Engineered nucleases are made up of two parts. The first part is nuclease part that cuts the DNA at a specific site. And the second part is DNA targeting part, which guides the nuclease to specific DNA sequence. Once the cut happens, the cell will naturally repair this damage by homologous recombination and non-homologous recombination pathways. And, we, and can we manipulate that to make changes in the DNA? By genome editing, we can make small DNA changes, removal of a section of DNA, or we can insert our gene of interest. Small DNA changes, engineered the nuclease cuts the DNA at a specific site. And as we said, the cell will naturally repair this damage by bringing the two cut ends back together. And this repair mechanism isn't 100% perfect, so a few bases are lost, few bases were added, introducing a mutation that affect the cell function. Removal of a section of DNA. Engineered the nuclease cuts a section of DNA, and as we said again, the cell will naturally repair that by bringing the two cut ends back together, but this time without the section removed. We can insert our gene of interest to gain our desired function. There are many systems of genome editing. Zinc finger nucleases, 1998, transcription activator like effector nucleases, 2010 and the CRISPR-Cas9 2013, the most common and the most efficient system of genome editing. But now, there are many scientific researches on genome editing. Jan 2013, on Marianne Leibert, zinc finger nucleases are used to treat AIDS by disrupting the coding sequence of co-receptor CCR5, which is responsible for the entrance of HIV. August 2013, on cell press, reading a frame correction by Talens, restores dystrophic expression on Duchenne muscular dystrophy patients. John 2014, on circulation research, permanent alteration of PCSK9 enzyme by CRISPR-Cas9 maintains your heart health. But alongside many benefits, there are some societal and ethical concerns to be considered. Genome ending raises the possibilities of designing babies and develop more virulent microbial diseases. So now, this technology is in our hand. It's time to debate how we use it, how we regulate it, avoid negative users to provide solutions to the world's biggest challenges. The references, and thank you. جينا لاخر ثلاث جوائز عندنا وهم
حارس امهم يا حارس امهم يا حارس امهم